Hey guys! Hey. hey. Where were you? Yeah, seriously, you were gone like six months. I was on holiday. What? Oh, that's nice. Where did you go? Oh, uh, hmm. You know what? I don't know. How can you not know? Yeah, what gives? Were you stoned the entire time? I guess so. I mean, what else could it be? Well, it's good to see you again, bro. Yeah, we really missed you at the agency. That's great to know. Huh? What the heck is that thing? Oh, this? I don't know, man. The general asked us to infiltrate a military operation, and while we were there, I saw this thing just sitting on a table next to some blueprints. Huh. I think you should ask Ralph. He's the expert around here. What do you think it is, Zero? Well, judging by the shape and size of it, I'd have to say it's some sort of expensive hairdryer. A hairdryer? Are you serious? Yeah, I'd put money on it. Okay, you're on. How much? 50? How about 100? Alright, you're on. Make it 200 if you want. You know what? Let's make it a nice round 500. <laughs> okay, whatever you say, man. So, Olivia, how are you? I'm okay. How's things for you? Eh, pretty good, I guess. I mean, except for the fact I have to go on a stupid search and rescue mission soon. Oh, really? Who needs rescuing? Hell if I know, but by the sound of their voices, I can easily see how they got themselves stuck on an island. You wanna go in mid this bit? Okay, I just hope you're ready to lose a week's wages. I'm not worried, but you should be. Bitch, please. Worried ain't even in my dictionary. Huh. Interesting. How did you come by this device, Agent 3? I found it whilst on a mission. It was sitting next to some blueprints. Hmm. Interesting. I would like to take a look at them. Do you have the blueprints? No. Do you need them? Well, no shit, I need them. How am I supposed to tell you what this thing is without blueprints? You're smart. Can't you just run a few tests or something? I'm sorry. I just simply don't have time right now. Leave it with me, and when I have time, I'll dismantle it and have a good look at it. Could you at least make a guess on what it is? <sighs> Well, judging by its complex shape and its remarkable size, I'd have to say it's a posh-looking hairdryer. Ugh, oh, you've got to be kidding me. I fucking knew it! Kiss my shiny armored ass, Agent Tree! Seriously, can everyone stop calling me that? Zero, I have good news for you. Ooh, am I finally getting that 70-inch plasma TV in my room? You're closer to having a smack bottom than that. I have located the distress signal from earlier. There's an airship waiting for you. Get your shit sorted and get going. Oh, and, uh, one last thing. I have a feeling when you get back, uh, we, we're gonna need a chat. Uh, so, uh, meet me in my office. <sighs> Great. I'll be right there, sir. Do you think you will be needing any gadgets, Zero? I doubt it. Good. Because you always break them. I just can't afford to keep repairing everything. You know what? On second thoughts, I'll take the most expensive gadget you have. nuh -uh. No way. Just one little gadget. Nine. Out of the question. All right. I'll just stick to my usual stuff then. Zero, be careful out there. Are you serious? Careful is my middle name. Ah, son of a... Seriously, who the hell left this on the floor? You were saying? <sighs> I hate you guys. You wanted to see me, Master? I have a simple task for you, Subject 8. 
I have a visitor coming here later that I will kill. Meanwhile, I want you to infiltrate the base of the agents. I thought we didn't know where it was. You are correct. But I have coordinates to their new base. I need you to go there and get to know them. Be buddy-buddy with them, you know, get acquainted. Try to become their new friend. I... I can't. What? You dare disobey my orders? It's not that. There's just someone there I need to avoid. You mean Catan? I thought you wanted revenge on him. No, not him. Someone else. Listen here. You best listen to me. I can stop your pitiful existence at any point I choose. Do you hear me? Yes, sir. Good. Now leave me. I have work to do. Do you have everything, sir? Yep. Are you sure? Yes. You're definitely positive about that. Pilot? Sir? What is your job? To pilot this heap of crap. Exactly! Now shut up and take off! Yes, sir! Asshole. I heard that. Hey, Olivia. What do you think? Yeah, you could do with a bit more practice. Oh, come on. I'm doing my best to impress you here. The least you could do is you pretend you fancy me. Sorry, I'm already taken. <laughs> By who? That's classified information. <laughs> Be honest. You don't have anyone, and you're too shy to express your feelings about my- Okay. I'll shut up. Hey, so Ralph had a good look at that weapon and- <laughs> You mean the hairdryer? For the last time. It's not a hairdryer. Funny, that's not what I heard. What? Yeah, Zero told me Ralph confirmed it was a hairdryer. No, he guessed it was a hairdryer. Anyway, that's not the point. After he ran a few tests on it, he said it was an infrared scanner. What's an infrared scanner? I don't fucking know. Ralph did explain, but I may have dozed off in the middle of it all. So, what's he gonna do with it? I'm not sure exactly, but he said something along the lines of making it a multi-purpose device. Like, um, a Swiss Army knife? Yeah, I guess so. Anyway, I'm gonna get going. When you see Zero, tell him about that weapon. <laughs> you mean a hairdryer. <laughs> it's not a hairdryer. Are we there yet? Sir, for the tenth time. No! Well, how long is this gonna take? It'll take as long as it needs. Oh, we're here! Okay, great! Land us. That's not such a great idea. If I fly any closer, they'll track us with that big round screen that goes beep. You mean their radar? Yeah, that thing. So, how long have you had your license? Wait, you need to have a license? Well, no shit. How the hell did you get hired? Well, I was just standing there, and this guy walks up to me, and he says, Excuse me, how would you like to be a pilot? Yeah, okay. I've always wanted to be a pilot. Well, that's great. Uh, just a quick question. Do you have any uh, piloting experience? Uh, no. Great, you're hired. What? Just like that? Yep. Don't I need some sort of license? Not for this mission, you won't. What will I have to do? <laughs> Don't worry. All will be explained later. He also told me to throw you out when we get there. Yep. That's General Katan, alright. Hmm. Wait. Did you just say... Asshole! Sorry! He's paying me! I think he broke my dick. Uh, nope, it's okay. Phew, that would have sucked. Hmm. 
So this is the place, huh? Doesn't look much like an island, that's for sure. Looks like a base of some kind, but there's no snipers or turret defenses. What gives? Was the general high when he sent me here? Also, who the hell am I talking to? Yes, General. I would like for you to shut down for a while. I'd rather be left alone with my thoughts. Is anything the matter, General? I just have a lot on my mind right now, is all. I'd appreciate it if you could leave me be. Would you like me to shut down all systems, General? No, just yourself, if that's alright. Certainly, sir. And I hope you feel better soon. <laughs> I'm taking a mighty big risk sending Zero. I just hope Van Dyke keeps his mouth shut. Uh, who's there? Agent. Agent who? Wait a minute, did I just... Uh... Agent Zero. So, what do you think of my new helmet? It's the same as your other helmet. Yeah, well, we work for Van Dyke and his dress code is everyone wears the same helmet. But, here's the thing, this helmet has a built-in cooling fan. Yeah, so does everyone else's. Wait, seriously? Yeah, it's a uh, standard issue. There wasn't one in my last helmet. Maybe you're not classified as a standard issue soldier because you suck so bad. <laughs> I do not suck. You're easily the worst aimer here. Oh please, I could shoot the dick off an Asian man from 30 meters away. That's like so amazing, man. Oh screw you, dickhead. Good one, huh? <laughs> Did you come up with that one yourself? Yeah, just like I came up your mom's vagina last night. Wow, a mom joke. <laughs> like I haven't heard those over 9,000 times. And now, I'll never have to hear it again. Oh yeah, by the way, put your goddamn hands up. You won't shoot me. I'ma do it. Don't do it. I'm doing it. Manhood. <laughs> hey, freeze! Stab me, you son of a bitch! Ow! What the fuck? Why'd you hit me? Ow! Son of a- oh, fuck! God, Jesus! Ah, fuck! Hey, can you hear something? What? I said, can you hear something? Dude, I can't hear shit in this helmet. Oh, really? I shagged your wife. What? Oh, so you heard that. What? You really want to hear what you want to hear, don't you? Yes, these are new shoes. No. I'd rather die from a grenade than talk to you. S 
son of a... Well, that's an issue. Hmm. Aha! Looks like I'm not out of the fight just yet. Hip. General, I was wondering if... Not now, Ralph. General, what's the matter? Nothing. I, uh... I'm busy as all. What do you want? I was wondering if you could take a look at the list I made for what equipment we're going to need for our new base. Can't it wait? I'm busy at the moment. How is your getting on? Is he almost done with his mission? Nah, and I doubt he'll ever be finished. Sir, I hope you don't mind me asking, but you seem a little off lately. Are you sure there's nothing going on? Look, stay out of it! Oh... Uh, oh, sorry, Ralph. I, uh... I'm not sure what came over me. It's fine. But if I can help with anything, just let me know. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, and sorry. Hmm, that's all. The General never says sorry or thank you. Something is definitely up. Wow, that was one heck of a climb. It's until now I actually realize how badly out of shape I am. Sir, are you seeing this? Yes, Zero, I saw it. Who was that guy? I don't know, but he didn't seem too friendly. He just saved my life, and you're saying he doesn't seem too friendly. What are you, high? Just get on with the mission. Fine. Zero out. Where have you been? I had something to take care of. Agent Zero is on his way here soon, and you cannot be here when he arrives. Yeah, I know. I'm going. I want you out of sight while he's here. After I'm finished with him, we'll discuss the plan. You got that? Loud and clear, sir. Now leave! Come on, Olivia. Let me have a go. <laughs> you... that's a joke. You can handle this weapon if you try. <laughs> I can handle any weapon. I have quite a monster of a weapon myself. 
Was that supposed to be a sex joke? Because that was in poor taste. I could teach you a thing or two about handling big weapons. Okay, show me what you can do. Really? Let's go to the broom closet. I was referring to my sniper. Oh, <laughs> alrighty, I'll give it a shot. Be careful, it's heavy. It's all about the girth, baby. You're so lame. Watch this. Wow, nice miss. You know, you're almost as bad as Zero with that thing. Damn it. Well, at least I'm still incredibly good looking. Compared to what? Oh, shut up. Idiots! How were they overpowered by a couple of untrained buffoons? Where do you think you're going? Uh, nowhere, sir. I just thought you might like to be alone. Oh, really? No, wait! You're right! I do want to be alone! That's what you get for sending me garbage! Never send a lackey to do an evil genius's job. I'll find some guards worthy of my time. That is it, Zero. Just in that room. Wait, seriously? This is the place? That seems to be where the signal is coming from. Yes. I thought they said they were stranded on an island. This is no island. Could be a trap. Don't say that. Very good. But who by? What even is this place? There's guards all over the place, but there doesn't appear to be anyone in charge. I, uh, I have to go somewhere. Ralph, hold the fort while I'm gone. But General, sir, where are you going? I just got shit to do is all. Let me know when Zero is on his way back. Ralph, speak to me, buddy. What am I looking at here? If I'm not too much mistaken, it looks like a computer. Huh, no, really? I thought it was a giant refrigerator. I'd say what you're looking at seems you're running a simulated program. But for what purpose? I'm not sure. Simulated? Freeze, dirtbag! Don't move! Wait, wait! What? I need to do an outro for this episode. Oh, oh my god. So, yeah, could, can I just, uh, like, if you could just, I mean... Okay, fine, but don't you even think about moving! Thanks, you're a star. Okay, I don't have much time to explain, but if you want to see more stuff on this channel, go click those thumbnails over there on the left side of the screen. Also, normally there would be a link to the next episode at the bottom of the screen, but YouTube decided to be a gluttonous pile of fuck and make it so I can no longer put annotations on my latest videos. So, sorry about that. Now then, where were we? I was holding you at gunpoint. Oh yeah, please continue. <laughs> Grrr.